Hey, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Volume 1 coming back with another music reaction video. And today, uh, we are going to be doing uh, an Immortal Disfigurement song that just popped off yesterday. Or last night in the middle of the night. Uh, I guess they dropped the whole album, but out of all the songs that they have dropped, I've already done three of them already because they released them as singles. Uh, King, Force Fed, and There Is No Light, I think is the third one is called. Uh, but today we're going to, um, the first two songs off this newly released album is King and Force Fed. So we're just going to hop right into the third song, which is called Crimson Vision. Uh, this band goes hard. I don't know if you've ever heard them or know anything about them or have heard the other, uh, reaction videos. Um, but know that they go fucking hard, filthy, nasty. It's going to be loud as fuck. I'm just trying to let you know that right away. I like this band a lot. CJ McCreary, McCreary is good, but I, I didn't like him so much in Lorna Shore, so I'm glad he's doing his own thing now, dude. Um, I just have a mad spot in my heart for Tom Barber and Lorna Shore, even with uh, Will Will Ramos in there now, dude. I just It's good. Don't ever get me wrong on that, dude. I just I grew up on Lorna Shore with Tom Barber, dude. My bad. But I'm glad CJ did something with his... God, I don't want to say did something with his life after all them allegations, but got an opportunity to move on and do something else. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know much about the allegations. I know that it seems to be like a he said, she said things, and sometimes abuse is... Sometimes in the eye of the beholder, too, and I don't ever want to be like that because uh, I... I believe I say victims, but sometimes what sometimes people think that that they're not really like they really don't think that they're doing it, dude. And I, I just I, I just don't. It's it's a real difficult subject to talk about, and I should just probably shut my fucking mouth, dude. Honestly, so I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> uh, but anyways, dude, here he is. Uh, He's back. He released an album. He's got a thing going on. So uh, that's what we're going to be peeping out today. Crimson Vision by Immortal Disfigurement. Now, uh, like I said, my name is Volume 1. If you like what you see, like what you're here today, please like and subscribe. I would love to have all of your support. If you are here for this, please check out the channels because I know that there's something else on there that you'll absolutely enjoy. Um, and as always, uh, if you are looking at my face and hearing my voice, always like to give a little puff out here to you. This is a sign of uh, respect and as my way of saying thank you so much for coming on through because it really does mean the world. So this goes out to you. Hello, hello. There we go. Whew. I got my Premier Pen ready. Getting ready to heat up right now. Holy shit. Let's turn this up. All right, ladies and gentlemen. <coughs> oh. oh, that's fine. That'll work. I present to you. I'm going to have to fix that, though. Hmm. Nope, I'm not going to be able to. It'll just how I have to be. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Immortal Disfigurement with Crimson Vision. Uh, like I said, it's going to be a banger, so get ready. Love y'all. Let's get it.
gentlemen that was crimson vision by immortal disfigurement uh off of their album that just dropped today uh king uh this is the fourth song that i've heard off of this album and look <clears throat> fucking raw don't ever th don't ever get me there i can't do that shit dude it's hard uh i wish there was more structure and i know that sounds weird but I wish there was more structure for me to get down with this more, dude. I mean, I'm trying to jam with it, dude, and I can't. I can't figure out what's going on. But I'm pretty sure that after a couple of listens, I will. But I'm going to say something here that people are not going to like, dude. I'm telling you right now. I feel, and I thought it would the last, maybe, the last song, maybe the last two songs that I've heard from Immortal Disfigurement. Ever since Will Ramos, 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 came out with Sun Eater. I can't remember the name of the song, dude. No, that's not what it is. Anyways, you know which one I'm talking about, dude. Where he, uh, Fuck! Now I can't think of the name of it, dude. But I think that CJ and the band are really trying to get the ending of that song. I absolutely... They, they've done it. It's like 
you guys are trying too hard to be like Lorna Shore on the on the end of that one song because everybody loves that song. You know, with the, the pig squeals and all that good stuff. I'm telling you, dude. And people aren't going to like that opinion. But go back and listen to it, dude. I I think that this band really caught on to the fact that they were doing that. And they just went with it, dude. Because people loved it. People loved Lorna Shore at the end when Will did all that. Three different breakdowns. You know what I mean? Like... I don't know, dude. I'm not going to say that they're copying, but I'm just going to say that they are most definitely imitating. But uh, it's good. Don't get me wrong, dude. I just wish there was more structure to it so I could enjoy it a little bit more, dude. It's just all over the place a little bit too much. Just a little bit too much. Um, but no, hey, I can't do that shit. I'm not hating. Just saying, dude. It's my opinion. Uh, all right, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, we heard uh, Myrtle Disfigurement with Crimson Vision off of their newest album, King. Uh, like I said, my name is Volume 1. If you like what you saw, like what you heard today, please like and subscribe. I would love to have all of your support. If you are here for this, please check out the channels because I know that there's something else on there that you'll absolutely enjoy as well then. Um, but, alright guys. Um, we still have quite a few songs left on this album to do, so I'll be back. I'll be back, obviously. I'll be back. Um, until next time, guys. Uh, be good, be safe, be wise. I love you all. Laters.